far, what we've learned is that the Taliban is taking responsibility for the killing of Ahmed Wali Karzai, a very controversial figure in Afghanistan. He is alleged to have had ties to the opium trade. He's alleged to have been on the payroll of the CIA, and he is alleged to have had ties to others, numerous other uh, illicit activities. Uh, he's actually, I mean, I think some people would, would certainly get the impression anyway that he was the guy who played all sides off against the middle, the, the CIA, uh, the world of drugs in which he was deeply involved, and the Taliban themselves. So why did they kill him now, do we know? So far they have not, why they would kill him, although they did call it one of their greatest victories in a decade-long war uh, against U.S. and NATO-led forces here in Afghanistan. Just why they would want to kill somebody so heavily or allegedly heavily involved in the opium trade uh, remains to be seen. However, having played all sides, he's certain to have made a number of enemies over the years. Charles? What, can we, what do we know about the uh, circumstances in, in which uh, he, he was killed? Well, to a representative in Kandahar, he was killed uh, in a king guest at his home. A guest, well, one of his own guards, shot him. And he was uh, pronounced dead soon thereafter. Okay, so he, he was shot dead at a gathering at his home, uh, uh, allegedly, by one of his own guards. Meanwhile, there's been an airstrike in, in another part of Afghanistan, uh, I gather. Uh, what do we know about that? Was that the work of NATO? Uh, I haven't uh, received word yet on where the, the strike was and, and if it was in reaction to this particular event. However, um, airstrikes are ongoing here and uh, throughout the country, particularly in southern Afghanistan, where U.S. forces have been concentrating on trying to eradicate the insurgency there, and eastern Afghanistan, where they're having an even more difficult time doing so.